In this video, I'm going to show you some hidden connector features that you might not know about, and they could save you money or increase the strength or just kind of unlock some new possibilities that you haven't thought of for the builds that you're working on. And if you don't even know what I'm talking about with building, then I want to mention first the Maker Pipe connector system are steel pieces of hardware that you can use with off the shelf electrical conduit. You can find these three sizes half inch, three quarter, and one inch EMT off the shelf at Lowe's, Home Depot, and places like that. And we have a few different connectors in the system that allow you to do different things. And I'll link some ones down below that we're talking about in this video, which is some like the adjustable angle hinge, the adjustable 180, the adjustable angle flange. We've done some videos specifically on those, and I'll link those down below. But what you might not realize is some of these connectors actually use the same piece of hardware and that would be the end clamp here, as you can see. And again, I've got half inch empty conduit with the half inch adapter shim and the three quarter inch end clamp. Then here I've got a three quarter inch piece of conduit with the three quarter inch end clamp. And then here is a one inch piece of conduit with the one inch end clamp. And we actually designed these to have the same width on the end of the connected piece of conduit here on the end clamp. And what this means, and I think this is really cool, what this means is you can actually interchange with other pieces of connectors in the system. So for example, I mentioned the adjustable 180. So let's say here that you've got a three quarter inch piece of EMT conduit that you use in the middle for your build and then you want to add some half inch EMT conduit bracing. Instead of using three quarter inch, you could save some money by going down to the half inch size. And this is actually designed so this gap between the two pieces of this middle clamp here, you can put the end clamp from any of the three sizes on there. So let's say even it makes sense in your project to do one inch EMT conduit on the opposite side. So then you've got three quarter inch in the middle and you've got one inch EMT conduit on this side and then a half inch piece of conduit on this side. So you're kind of mixing all three sizes here. And you can do this with other connectors in the system as well, such as the puzzle piece clamp. So here I've got a piece of one inch EMT conduit and then this is the one inch puzzle piece clamp and normally you could use the, the one inch, the bottom half of the, the connector, the one inch end clamp, and you can make the adjustable angle hinge for one inch MT. But because this dimension here is the same, and because we designed these end clamps to have the same dimension on the end, you can interchange these. So instead of one inch, you could use a piece of half inch MT conduit with the adapter shim and three quarter inch end clamp and create an adjustable angle hinge that utilizes two different sizes of conduit and this could save you money, like I said, if you wanted to you know, go down in size and use the smaller diameter conduit that's a little bit cheaper at the hardware store, or you could increase strength if you have a smaller build that's all out of half inch EMT conduit, and then you add in some one inch EMT bracing and increase the strength. So you can do some, some really cool things with those combinations. And on the website, we've put on the connector pages each of the pieces individually. So if you want to mix and match sizes, you can do that. You just select, for example, the one inch puzzle piece clamp and then the half inch end clamp, and then you can combine those for your project. So a lot of cool possibilities. I really like this one. Hope you guys did too. If you did, leave a like and consider subscribing. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.